Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and today we have for you a 2008 Audi All Road. It's the Generation 2. It's got the 3 litre turbo diesel engine and obviously it's a Quattro being an All Road. They've got the same engine in the big Q7 Q5 and the A8. It's got plenty of power yet a very good fuel consumption. It's done 128,000 kilometres and it has a very good service history to it with every single service being done on time. This new series of All Road was a significant improvement on the previous model which came out in around 2001. It's more reliable, it looks a lot better, it's got much better engines and a new, ge and a new gearbox. It still has all the things you do want like your adjustable suspension, system which, uh, which actually works very very well. This car's been optioned with a tow bar as I can see here. It's got an electric tailgate. And I think represents excellent value for money. When you consider this car would have cost well over $100,000 when it was new. The back seats fold down like the older series. The three litre V6 turbo diesel engine is silky smooth quiet and powerful. This car is jade black, I believe it's called. It's got black leather interior, so it's a good colour if, if you've got a family. As much as we like these wagons with their beige interiors, they do wear pretty quickly. It's also got navigation and Bluetooth. Dual zone climate control and heated electric seats. It's, uh, you can see there's a sunroof there and it's got Audi roof racks. The alloy wheels are very good, it's got nice tyres. Looking down the side there doesn't seem to be any dents or scratches. Uh, they come standard with set on lights, parking sensors front and rear. And a really, just an all round beautiful car. I haven't seen many update Audi all roads. Most of them seem to be from 2001, 2, 3, 4, and 5. We'll start it up. So it's nice and smooth. There's your navigation. I can hear the parking sensors, and it does have a reverse camera. That is a huge benefit if you're using your tow bar. You can look like an absolute pro when backing up to a trailer. We'll have a quick look at the log books as well, which are in the glove box where they should be. Oh, yeah, nice chunky log book, which is great. Let's take the service book out because I think that's the most important. So I can see at 116,000 kilometres there was a major service, drive belt and tensioners replaced. New coolant and that was done by Audcare who's an Audi specialist on the North Shore. And then there was other servicing done by Audcare as well at 124,000, 115,000, 105,000 and the list goes on. So it does have a very good service history to it indeed. Obviously it has done over 100,000 kilometres but it looks like it's had all its major servicing done. The newer series came with an electric handbrake as well. And I think they're just absolutely gorgeous. 
at the click of a button you can raise the suspension by about five centimeters if you are going to do a little bit of off-road work or if you've got a property and you've got a bumpy road or a bumpy dirt driveway which can get slippery something like this would be fantastic we do specialize in european cars we're called the old timer center our showroom is in marrickville and we do have about 70 vehicles in stock at the present time thanks again for watching and we look forward to hearing